Am I the asshole? For asking my stepdaughter to cook for us. My stepdaughter is a phenomenal cook. I'm talking homemade pasta sauces, scratch baking, hell, sometimes imported seasonings. But she only does it for herself. She's been fine cooking when I ask her to do it for us, but only on rare occasions. When we're all busy and need to do DIY dinner nights and can't all sit around the table, you can smell her homemade garlic pesto or vegan teriyaki stir fry all over the house, and it gets irritating. We get her ingredients that she uses up quickly and never makes meals to share with, and I'm getting annoyed. So I asked her earlier tonight if she would start making dinner for us all more frequently I didn't say every night and she got annoyed and mouthy with me, saying she's drowning in schoolwork, her internship, and her commission's very talented digital artist and can't babysit us because you never learned to cook. She claims her sparse dinner preparations are a treat when she's up to the task and feeling nice, and she can't be expected to come up with something new and fresh every night. She's doing it for herself anyway, why not for the rest of us? So I told her to just do the dishes and go to her room. She did the dishes and stomped off and hasn't come out since, and my wife thinks I'm TA here, but I think I'm in line. She lives under my roof and doesn't pay rent, and she's already cooking every night for herself anyway. Am I the asshole? Info How often do you cook dinner for the family? It's a DIY dinner night because all of you are busy and you get irritated by the smell of what she's cooking? Stop right there, you are an R. You're the asshole. She isn't supposed to be paying you rent. She's a minor child your attitude of it being my roof is pretty crappy. That attitude tells us some very unflattering things about you. She doesn't have to cook for you. Sure, everyone once on a while like once a month would be very nice. But she doesn't have to. But are you buy her groceries and she doesn't pay rent BC she is 17. Learn to crackpot cook or batch cook. Edit crockpot not crackpot. You're the asshole. Your 17 year old doesn't pay rent? That's because her mom is legally responsible for providing housing, food, etc. for her child. She shouldn't be responsible for routinely cooking for the family. You should be grateful for the fact that she routinely cooks for herself, rather than relying on her adult parents to provide food for her. Maybe you and your wife should take some cooking classes. You're the asshole. Learn how to make pesto or teriyaki if you want to eat those things. She's the child and you're the adult. It could have been a bonding moment between you, but instead you clearly resent her and don't have any interest in a parental relationship with her. You're the asshole for thinking someone with school, an internship and an art business doesn't have the equivalent of a full-time job, and for asking her to take on more household responsibility without compensation one way or the other money, fewer other chores, etc. Also you make it sound like you asked but your reaction sounds more like you told her to cook for you. This is the most entitled post I've read today. Buy a cookbook. And why on earth would you think that a high school student owes you rent? You're the asshole, massively. Your underage stepdaughter doesn't have to pay rent she lives with her mother. You're the asshole. She's under 18 so complaining about her not paying rent under your roof does your wife not contribute to this household? Is absolutely inappropriate. Learn to cook your damn self. Maybe ask her nicely to make enough for everyone once in a while, or find a way to compensate her for doing so. You're the asshole. She lives under your roof. Says just about everything needed you don't treat us as family but want to just have her as unpaid domestic help. She lives there and you'll buy her food because she is a minor, if you didn't want to be a father figure or supportive to her, treat her like family. You shouldn't marry a woman with kids hell you shouldn't even been dating her. You're the asshole she's 17 it's your responsibility to buy her groceries and pay her rent because she's a child. No wonder she doesn't want to cook for you when it's super obvious you don't even like her. You're the asshole. I don't think you approached this the right way. She's not paying rent because she is still a minor. 
The idea of cooking for everyone might stress her out. You're the asshole. Why is a minor child cooking every night for herself in the first place? She does have a FT job school. Plus a PT job and an internship. And she is a child. Get in the kitchen dude. You're the asshole I saw your comment you're almost 50 and can't do much but noodles and pizza? Imagine getting annoyed at someone cooking stuff then expect that person to cook for you. Also, she's not an adult so she shouldn't pay rent. You're the parent, not her, so you should be cooking. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. You're whining because your wife's minor child isn't paying rent or cooking you dinner? This reminded me of the guy who didn't understand why the neighbor wouldn't cook for him for five dollars a night. You're the asshole. Like really an asshole. She does have multiple jobs. She has her art commission job, she has her internship which is an unpaid job, and she has her studies. And on top of that she has to cook for herself. You being a baby and whining that she doesn't cook for you and that a minor doesn't pay for her rent or groceries is just not a good look at all. Do better. She's 17. Why would she be paying rent? And Google is free. You can search those recipes and make those dishes with the ingredients you buy anytime you like. You're the asshole she's 17, not alive in cook. You're the asshole for three reasons. You're not her father number one. Number two she's 17 and still in school so let her focus on that. Do not bring the thought of rent in this situation because she will more than likely not abide. Number 3 and based by your comment that you're a miserable cook myself but try sometimes. You need to pick up the slack. She is not alive in cook. Yes you are out of line. Have a little respect for her. I guess I need more info. Does she cook for herself every night and you'll never cook for her? Is she still in high school? Are the ingredients she's using ones that you'll buy for the household and she's using up making additional things? You're the asshole. That's one way to ruin cooking for a young person. Be happy that she's self-sufficient and interested in cooking for herself but she's still the kid and punishing her for not wanting to cook for you is bad parenting. Maybe you should follow her example and learn to cook yourself, so you don't rely on a child to do it for you. You're the asshole. If she was older I'd say she should pay for her own ingredients, but she's a teenager exploring a hobby that makes her happy. Getting her to cook for everyone takes the joy out of it for her. If she's cleaning up after herself and being respectful otherwise then leave her be. And learn to cook. You're the asshole. She's 17. You don't charge a minor child rent. She's not your servant. And you've tanked any chance of establishing a friendly exchange by being a total asshole to her. You're the asshole. Cooking for several people takes longer and takes more effort than cooking for one person. People who actually cook know this. She's busy too, and she's a busy child with schoolwork and a burgeoning career. You, the adult, have lots of options to feed yourself that don't involve her.